Let's start with the uh, first one here. The right to travel is part of the liberty of which a citizen cannot be deprived without due process of law under the, f under the Fifth Amendment. This right was emerging as early as the Magna Carta. Kent v. Dulles. And, well, that's, and that's fairly recent, by the way. That's 1958. That's <clears throat> fairly recent. Right. The essential elements of due process of law are notice and the opportunity to defend. Mm. Was I given okay. an opportunity to defend? Was I given notice? So, so okay, the right cannot be deprived without due process of law. Okay, so at whatever point you want to stand on your right, is that uh, abstaining from a driver's license? Is it having a driver's license and then getting into court over something? Uh, well, you know, wherever you are, at whatever point, uh, well, hey, excuse me, what about my rights? The essential elements of due process of law are notice and opportunity to defend. If you do not receive notice and opportunity to defend, this goes back to what, what uh, W.D. Was, was questioning, though. He's saying that, you know, he doesn't believe we were right because, you know, as Sovereign, we acted on our own accord and we initiated the driver's license application and, blah, and whatever. However, the code says I have to have a driver's license within 30 days of uh, entering the state from some foreign jurisdiction or from the time I turn 16 or whatever, if I want to operate a motor vehicle, I have to have a driver's license. And because of that, I believe that, that there, is, uh, there is a case to be made that, that, that I did not initiate the request for application. The state did. 